With election day now upon us, Americans have not been the only ones keeping up with who is closer to getting that Oval Office. We stopped and talked to Londoners around the South Kensington area and Imperial College to learn about their final thoughts on this year's election. Madness, yeah. A joke, that's what I feel. Catastrophe, I think. Disheartening. They've shamed each other a lot more than in previous elections. Like it's it's very personal. Like when you listen to the debates and things. I watched the first one. It's, it's more like attack of each other and less talk of the politics and things that people would be interested in. It's quite hard to avoid. Like it's everywhere. Uh... Londoners have expressed more of their support towards Hillary Clinton over Donald Trump. But at least she has a political career. Um, so I'd probably choose her over him. But Trump, I'd say, is even even worse in a sense or even scarier that with the things he says just don't make sense and they don't add up so patrick gorman an american turn uk citizen expresses how most of his colleagues question him on if he's been keeping up with what our two candidates have been saying um and it's interesting to talk with other people about how they feel the election is going and to get my reactions on how I think it's going to go as if I'm an expert, so. With all of the heightened attention of this year's election, as Londoners have said, they can only hope that America will soon have their first female president. I think Hillary will win. Hillary. Clinton. <laughs> Clinton, definitely, yeah. I'd like to think probably Clinton wins it and then um, I think she's a natural and she'd be a natural statesman. It'd be great to have the first woman president in the United States. 